lights camera action what are we doing this or fix it <laughs> there's nothing we can't fix we can learn along the way as well but uh what i'm doing is i'm doing a i'm installing an led lights or led turn signal lights on my 2008 heritage soft tail i already got the leds on there the led lights on there i'm just going to walk you through from here uh, but it's pretty easy to, on, on 08 to take the lights off. You only got two screws here and here you pop it, the lens cap off. Okay. And this is the LED for the front. And you can see the ring, the yellow ring on this stack of LEDs circular. And then you know that's the front. The back doesn't even have the yellow ring. And this is, this switches from amber to bright. And then you can tell if it's the front. You've got three wires, yellow, white, and black. The rear wire only has, the rear uh, turn signal only has black and red. And the pin, when you're going to push this in, the two pins that hold this up, up in here, they are, are even, right? On the tip of it, you'll see it. Uh, they're not uh, opposite, uh, up and down of each other. So you, yeah. When you can tell it's got two copper end connectors on the tip of the uh, of the this here piece okay so that's one way you can tell it's the front you may want to use that pliers to put this on uh, or a pair of gloves because it's pretty sharp right there and uh, these things are sharp but uh yeah this is the front i'm going to turn this on so you can see how bright it is uh i didn't take a picture before but yeah it's pretty obvious I'm going to go over and turn it on, give it some power. Okay, power's on. And both lights are on. <laughs> you can see how yellow from the, the, the lights are, and then the LEDs down there like super bright because it's facing down. So we're going to hit the turn signal. Okay. And that, that right there, if you did not put the... The resistor on there, the equalizer, it will blink faster for the rear light. Right now it's blinking normal because I already got the adapter on there. The, uh, the resistor uh, on there, I ordered that separate on Amazon. So, take a look at it here. Make sure you wear a pair of gloves so you don't just touch the lens. I never like touching these LED lights uh, itself. The this Where my hand is is fine, but see how it changes from amber to bright? Yeah, really, really cool. And the same thing on the other side. Okay. See how bright that is? Super duper bright. Yeah, really cool. A lot safer, I think. And you can see a lot better on the road. I haven't done the headlights yet, but that's in the works. So we got the front hooked up. I'm going to go to the rear. Basically the same thing. Look at the rear. Turn signal bright, bright red. Okay, so you see how it's hooked up here. You only get two wires instead of three wires. You get a red and black. And again, this one here is uh, odd between each other on the pins. But uh, and what's really cool, these this thing came, the LED lights came with resistors. Okay, but I did not use these type of resistors because I didn't want to drill holes to put this on to connect wires and cut wires. And it also came with four smoke lens, okay? And they're a little bit darker than my original lens. This is the original mine, and mine is smoke as well, but not as dark. But I kind of like the darker one. So we're going to use these. You're going to need your screws, because they didn't come with screws. And then the other thing that I ordered separate from the LED lights was the resistor right here. It's all plug and play. Yeah, this one here, I don't have to drill any holes, cut any wires. It just fits perfect. Now, when you order this on Amazon, you can order them cheaper because there was one guy that did a video and he, he paid $120 on the link that he shared. And I'm like, wow, that's crazy. And I got these for about 19 bucks. Okay. There's others that are like 27 a little over 20 bucks. That's not too bad either. But I got this for 19 and uh, it stopped the... The quick blinking flash. This is blinking normal right now. But if I took this off, this resistor equalizer off, um, 
it will blink fast. And that, that people complain that the lights don't last too long and they burn out. Well, they burn out because you don't have the load resistor on there. Yeah, the equalizer. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and turn that off. All right. So, front LED lights facing down, nice and bright. The red one, I got my garage light open, so you can't really see. Uh, no, well, I don't have it on, but, um, yeah. I haven't tested it on the road, but it's going to be obvious the difference in, in the lights and stuff, that it's a lot brighter when you're when this is on in the front and the... When you, Turn on the left rear red headlights, or rear turn signal lights. So that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, I think I'm, I'm pretty satisfied with it. We'll see how long it lasts. Um, it, I was thinking of ordering an extra set for down the road just in case uh, they burn out or something. But LEDs are supposed to last longer than the normal, uh, the original um, factory ones. But I, I like the idea to put LEDs, uh, less load on the battery, and then they last longer, and they're a little bit safer to write with. They're brighter, they can see you. And that's the thing about safety, we want to be seen. So same thing with the headlights and the fog lights. I want to get those changed. And I saw a demonstration of one of the YouTubers. So anyway, that's where we're at. I'm going to go ahead and share this with you guys so you can see. And if you want to do the same thing to your bikes, I think it's really cool. And uh, yeah, bye.